Welcome to Same Spit Different Face Podcast. Well, my opinions is facts, and if you don't like my opinions, you can start your own podcast. It is free, so don't forget to click the like button, the subscribe button, and the notification bell. Also, my cash app and Hip Hop Artist of the Week in the description. So, let's talk Meg the Stallion. Also, follow Same Spit Different Face on Instagram and click the like button on the video now. Spit Squad, Meg Thee Stallion has released a statement. I'm sure it's a PR statement. I can tell by the way it's structured. It says, the narrative that is being reported about Sunday morning events are accurate, and I'd like to set the record straight. On Sunday morning, I suffered a gunshot wound as a result of a crime that was committed against me and done with the intention to physically harm me. I was never arrested. The police officers drove me to the hospital where I underwent surgery to remove the bullet. I'm incredibly grateful to be alive and that I'm expected to make a full recovery, but it was important for me to clarify the details of this traumatic night. I'm currently focused on my recovery so I can return back to life and back to making music as soon as possible. And that's the statement. Her caption on it is, I was never arrested. The whole experience was an eye opener and a blessing in disguise. I hate that it took this experience for me to learn how to protect my energy. So, to me, what she's alleging is that Tory Lanez shot her. Now, I don't know if they were in a relationship together. I know we've seen them together a lot, but what I would, what it sounded like I'm hearing from everything that I've gathered, gathered is that um they were at a party of some sort. Maybe some guys was in her face. Maybe she was in some guy's face. Um, Maybe she was trying to um, get Tory Lane some of that G-E-Easy treatment. You know, that get away from me treatment or that I do what I want. I'm a boss woman type, uh, ride the boat type energy. And Tory Lane's couldn't accept that. And they got into an altercation for whatever the case is. Now, I'm only putting out this theory because she's saying that she was shot and she's speaking about protecting her energy. And um, if Tory Lanez was a great friend and he did nothing to her and he had nothing to do with the involvement of her being shooting, what I would say is that the first thing she should have put in that was, yo, Tory's a great friend of mine or... um. You know, Tori, I'm with you 100%. I support you. Or thanks for being there for me. But what it sounds like is that she's throwing him under the bus either because he did something or either because she can exercise off the sympathy of people believing or it appearing that he did something. So I don't know as of right now, but it's a very crazy situation. And I instantly thought about it right when it was said and i might have said in my other video i'm like where did the glass come from like how did glass get on her how did she cut her foot on the glass and what it sounded like is that that was a pr story that tory lane's people put out to flip the situation and possibly they put that out to kind of try to save tory lane's until they can probably talk or get in touch with Meg Thee Stallion and have her corroborate that story or until they can figure out exactly what they was going to do about the situation. But I'm sure more will come from this, so y'all need to click that subscribe button so I can keep y'all up to date with it. Also, drop below in the comments and let me know what you think of this and Hip Hop Artist of the Week in the description is free. So click the like button, the subscribe button, and the notification bell. Peace.